So I was a little bit skeptical or nervous when I wanted to tow 6x12 uh, trailer from U-Haul on my RAV4 2016. But um, so when I tried to look at the videos um, on YouTube, you know, other RAV4s towing trailer this size, but I couldn't find really a lot of videos. So I want to make a video, it's going to be a video review, a couple tips I learned maybe real quick and also show you the size. To be honest, RAV4 is not meant to tow a lot of weight. But I want to show you a couple things. The first thing that I kind of was worrying about, um, this thing right here, when I actually got it, they didn't Put it correctly they didn't tie it all the way so when you tie this the ball there is like fixing so they left it open and I was towing and I got a speed bump and it's actually got out and it hit and it hits right there it hit my really really kind of bad so thanks God it didn't hit the car but it was unsafe, so make sure whenever you double check, because even you whole guys can forget to tie this thing down. All right, real quick, the wiring. Got the wiring, all the wire, all the lights work. And um, yeah, so I hope you find this video a little valuable. Just want to show if you have any questions, whoever is trying to, I have a LE version RAV4 2016 front, front wheel drive nothing special no limited no four-wheel drives nothing it's the basic model and it tows uh, so if you I want to show you if tow, if tow is that size kind of trailer very very okay look at the trailer and look at the car the trailer is bigger than the car so really quick update we loaded a little bit in the trailer so you can almost stand up here. I'm six foot, uh, six feet or foot. Um, so this is a queen size bed. It fits perfectly. We're loading, trying to load really light on the back of the car. Uh, but let me show you real quick. That's how it looks right now. Uh, what I wanted to show real quick is the is really low right now. You can see, and this is really high. Uh, that's again one angle showing how close. Not super close, actually. There is enough room. And we'll try to load the front heavy. Okay, final load that's how it looks like that's what we're dealing with still a lot of room left front heavy hope you can see it okay so here we go driving trailer back Sounds heavy, mm -hmm. but it, I don't even put the gas pedal. It just drives by itself like normally, you know? Okay, right now we're driving 55. Actually on the lower speed, what I noticed, the chains were touching the, the road and um, Dragon Turnpike chains were touching the road and it sound bad but once you get the speed up it actually goes the one concern that I have should I go in a lower like speed 3 or 4 yeah I should probably drive on 4 yeah right now it says on 4 I should probably just keep it on 4 and uh, yeah it goes well hope transmission can survive and Sounds good, everything good. Trailer is right here in the back. Focus, focus, <laughs> focus. 
That's a beautiful shot. <laughs> like in the movie. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you for watching. Don't be scared, RAV4 Kento.